Ashin uh, did this which problem? Third problem. So after Hashid, it is uh, Amar. Right, Amar? No, no, Amar did this problem. Right, yeah. Third question, Amar did. So now, Asha, so that is your right? Oh, yes. Wait, we have a new student? Okay, nice. Okay, so let me let me give a quick recap to uh, Salah. So I did the third question. Oh, you did. Uh, okay, Hashi. Then it is a mark. Sir. So a very quick recap, guys, for Salha, that uh, we studied about uh, success, right? So first, yeah. So we have a circle whose. Uh, distance from a fixed point is uh, from fixed point is same and the distance is called uh, the radius right so in circle uh, we studied few things one thing uh, one thing is about second and tangent so when a line intersects the circle at two points so tala this is called uh, second and uh, for rest of you guys, this may, may be boring, but uh, bear with me for five minutes. Okay. So this is called second tala whenever the line intersects at two points. And then whenever line intersects at uh, one point, so that is called uh, the tangent. The tan okay, tangent. Tangent. Okay. Yeah, tangent. Tangent and second. So two points. Second, one point, tangent. And then there is a peculiar property. So this is theorem one. It says that, it says that whenever we have a circle and uh, we draw a tangent, and then this is called point of contact. So we join the point of contact to the center. So this is what, uh, Tala? From the center to the point on circle. What is this? Point of con uh, radius. Radius, right? So, uh, radius. Okay, so this is radius and then this is tangent. So this radius, this peculiar radius, not this one, this one, this one. This peculiar radius, which is uh, which is made by joining the point of contact and the center. So this radius would be perpendicular to the tangent. This is a ten point one theorem. Okay, and then we have the next the theorem, which says that who oh, joined? Who uh, joined? Sure. Shobo okay. joined. Shobo. Oh, Shobo. So you you call him Shobo? Like mm, name. I give. Okay. okay. Good, good one, good one. So this is a good one. Uh, friends are supposed to give a very bad system, right? So yes. You should give a... <laughs> I... <laughs> no, 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 no. So this is a bad system. Okay. So, yeah. So the second uh, theorem we learned that we have a circle and we take a point on the outside. So from the outside, we can have only two tangents. And the theorem says that uh, these two tangents would be equal. So let's say that this is A, this is B. So, and then this is P. So this theorem says that PA equal to A. So these are the things that we have learned in the circle. Okay, Tala. That's it. Okay. That's it. That's it. That's it. Okay. And uh, one more extension that uh, these two angles are these Equal. two angles are no 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 supplement. Oh. supplement. Sub so let's say no. this is x, this is y. So x plus y is one. These are the things that we have done so far. Right. Okay. Uh. Okay, so now let us go back to the questions that we were doing. Right. So, Amar, the next is the uh, next question is this, right? 
ओके तो नो नो मे बी दिस इज आयशा क्वेश्चन बिकॉज द सेकेंड क्वेश्चन अमार्ट आई रिमेंबर सेकेंड क्वेश्चन so i said this is your question right yes sir okay so prove that the tangents drawn at the end of at the ends of a diameter of a circle are bad so we have this circle right and then at the end of the diameter so let us draw the diameter first this is a diameter passing through center okay and then this is point a and then this is point b so it is uh, saying that we have to prove that oh, we have to prove that these are parallel and uh, yeah we have to prove that this let's say this is uh, what yes amar you are you saying something now no we cannot hear you we cannot hear you amar yeah so let's say that this is line l and this is line f so we have to prove uh, aisha we have to prove that l parallel to f right so yes sir yeah and we already know this much so what should we do aisha um so since we already know that a line perpendicular a tangent will yes. have the radius perpendicular to it yes so yes. um let me let me name the angle then it will be clear right so let me say yes. that this is some p q and so let's say that this is r and uh, s so we can also prove that uh, p q parallel to it. Okay. So this is the answer. Right now. now tell me, what do we do? So angle OAP is equal to ninety degrees. Okay. And um, then angle SBO. SBO. Right, so O B is uh, equal to ninety yes. degrees. Yes, which means that, which means that what? So from both of these equations, we can learn that angle O A P is equal to angle O B S. Yes, absolutely right. Yes, good. So which means that. AP is a transverse. PQ and RS are two lines, and this, these are alternate interior angles, right? So yes, these sir. are these are uh, alternate uh, interior angles, which means that PQ parallel to RS, right? Or we can also say that uh, OAP or OBR. This is also equal to ninety ninety. So if we add these two, then this is also ninety. So angle on the same side of transversal, interior angle on the same side of transversal, their sum is one eighty. So this is again parallel. So we can choose any method for that. Right? Good. Everybody, is this uh, clear? Clear. Yes. Yes. Yes, Tala, Rizwan, Shaima, Amar, Shweb. Is this uh, clear? Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay, you guys, uh, please note it down. Then uh, after Aisha, then we are back to Rizwan, then Tala, to the cyclic concepts. Right. Good, good, uh, good, Aisha. So quickly, you guys, quickly note it down. And if you have any questions, so please uh, ask.
Yes, everybody, if everybody has noted it down, please, sir. What, sir? Done. No, I'm yes, saying that. Uh, okay. No, repeat. Yes. Yeah, noted everybody. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Okay. Yes. Okay. So then, oh, why did I raise the question? Let me. To the fifth question. Okay, is one question for you. So the question is that prove that the perpendicular at the point of contact. So this is B point of contact. Uh, to the tangent to a circle passes through the center. So we have to prove that this O is center, right? Uh -oh. so we have to yeah. prove that uh, O is center. Okay, how should we do that? Um, we have to first prove, uh, prove the um, Hmm. I don't know if it has proved the 90 degree. Yeah, so we already know that if O B perpendicular to R, which means that O B is a radius. Mm -hmm. Right? Yes. Sir. From theorem uh, 10 point. Right. So now mm -hmm. if OB is radius, then what is this O? O is the center uh, of O um, is the center. Right. So this was the question. I don't know why they asked this question. So this was the question. Mm -hmm. Okay. And uh, yeah, so today after so many days, Tala has come. So no question for today uh, to you, Tala. Okay. So. Okay. Yeah, because uh, we should not uh, bombard you with uh, so many question on your first day. Ah, so, uh, yes. But the second day will be like, oh my God. Okay, so the first day will be the ripples of the uh, second day would be the ripples of the first day, and then from the third day, we'll ask you the question, right? So, first two days are okay. No problem. Okay, so who's uh, yeah, everybody please note it down, and if you guys have any questions, so please ask. Done, sir. No, sir. Yes. Ashit, Shaima, Amar, and uh, Aisha. And, uh, okay, so now, next question, right? Yes, sir. So, next question is uh, Shaima, right? Okay, uh, where is the question? Fifth one. Oh. So, prove that the perpendicular, uh, so this uh, we did. Oh, right? so we did that. So, six one. So, the length of a tangent from a point uh, at a point A at a distance five centimeter from the. So, the length of a tangent. Length of a tangent uh, is four centimeters. So, this part is the information. This part we have to. Point A. So from point A, distance five centimeter from the center. So this is center, and this is point A, and uh, this is uh, five centimeter. Okay, your mic is not working, Amar. Okay, so then no question, no question for you as well. Okay, Amar. So you just uh, here. And if you have a doubt, uh, please uh, write it in the chat box. Okay, Amar? 
no worries no worries so and then there is uh, this tangent so so this is 5 cm this is uh, how much this is 4 cm and uh, we have to find out this is what let's say b so we have to find out uh, what is can I try restarting my laptop? Okay, okay, yeah, okay. Please, uh, if if that, yeah. So if that works, please uh, do that. So we the question is that what is the uh, OB sharp? Yeah, very very difficult question, right, guys? Three. Three. <laughs> oh, you didn't. Uh, good. So how can ready? you do that? Huh? How can you do that fast? Yes, so <laughs> she remembers the triplets. Mm -hmm. and, oh, uh, just using five theories. Yeah. So then I got three. Wow. Yeah. Yes, Aisha. Sir, I also got three. Yes, 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 yes. Good. Sir, I also got three. Yes, good, good. So everybody is getting Sir, I also got three. Wow. <laughs> Okay, so everybody is getting uh, three. Hashid, what about you? And Shweb? Yeah, so I didn't ask everyone. So, yes. Three, three. Good. So, this question was very quick. So, the circle chapter is looking right. But then we get uh, this question and then we get uh, what? And then we get this one. This one is uh, okay. okay. So now whose turn is it? Um, our mic is not working, so we have uh, Hashi, right? So uh, where is the seventh question? Eighth question I will do right. Eighth, uh, ninth. Uh, okay, so eighth, ninth. Uh, I yeah, so two concentric circles of uh, RF radii. We have uh, two concentric circles. What is uh, meant by concentric, Hashid? So, uh, circle uh, over another circle. Circle over another circle. So, but precisely, uh, let's say that uh, we have this circle and then we have uh, this circle. Right, so is this concentric? What is the name that is uh, concentric? A circle on top of an other circle. Yes, that is the right answer. The second one is the right answer. So the circle which uh, shares the common center, same center, yes. So if two circles have uh, same center, right, then that is called the concentric. Con meaning same, center meaning center. So concentric circle. Okay, good. Now the question is that uh, of radii 5 centimeters, so the bigger one radii is uh, 5 centimeters. And uh, this is 3 centimeters. Okay. Find the length of the chord of the larger circle with touches the smaller circle. So we have this. This is the chord which touches the smaller circle. So this is O. Let's say this is A, this is B, and then this is uh, M. So we have to find out uh, what? We have to find out what is uh, AB. So how will we find uh, out Hashit? Hmm. How will we find? So, if I draw the correct figure, then it would be easy. That's why I I didn't uh, draw that picture. Hmm. How will we find uh, the A B? So uh, we have to join O to A and uh, O to B. Good. Good, good. So, O to A and uh, this part we don't need. 
but uh, because this part and this part are equal right so this so we only need to calculate am and then multiply it by this good good so now you have this is 3 this is 5 so what is this am yes Yes, Harshit, what is this AM? Are you saying something? Uh, oh, so you already told me the answer. So 4, which means 4. So AB is 8. Right, so uh, I didn't write anything on this uh, question. Okay. But you guys understood, right? So first we found out what is AM. AM is uh, in your school whenever these kind of question has been asked. So you write properly. You write that uh, OA is uh, 5. You write uh, OM is uh, 3. Then you write AM is uh, root of uh, OA square minus uh, OM square. So in this way you write uh, 5 square minus 3 square which is 4 square which is 4. So in this way you write in your school exam but uh, directly we can write uh, like this. So AM is 4 so AB is uh, 2 a which means 2 into 4 which is 4. Okay. And that's because uh, we have this concentric circle. If the circles are not concentric, then these two would be not equal. Okay. Uh, any doubt in this question? Yes, good, good, Harshit. So, any doubt in this question, right? No, sir. Good. So, yeah, everybody, please uh, write it down. And uh, whoever has any question, any doubt, please ask. We have half an hour and we have 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 16. Done, sir. Then, uh, everybody, yes. Yes, sir. This one, Tala, Shaima, Shweb, and uh, Amar. Yes, Amar, is your mic uh, working now? Mic is uh, not. So, yes, you guys, please uh, quickly note it down and tell me, yeah, when you guys have noted. Okay, okay. Good, good. So now your mic is uh, working. Yeah, so second. Um... Yes, do you have any question, Amar? Uh, sir, can you, uh, what, can you go to the previous question? Previous question? Sixth one. Yeah, the sixth, sixth one. one. Okay, so did I erase that part? Yeah, so let me draw it. Uh, do you have any question in that? Uh, so like, can you just show it once? Uh, I'll just try to answer myself. Oh, okay, okay. So this sixth question is uh, this one. So you have, uh, this is the picture of this expression. So you have this uh, tangent and then this uh, distance. This is five, this is four, and then you have to find out uh, this distance. This is, let's say, B. Okay. So this was the sixth question. Okay, Amar. Yes, Amar. Uh, this was the this was the sixth question, and uh, this was uh, the answer because this is OB is root of five square minus four square which is root of 9, which is So this is how we calculated. Uh, 
Yes. Do you have any doubt, Amar? Uh, no, sir. Good. Uh, so everybody uh, noted it down. Uh, the seventh question. Yes, sir. So now let me. Okay, Asha. So eighth uh, question is more uh, time, so I will help. Right. So we have this uh, quadrilateral, right? Okay, this may be a, a different quadrilateral, but. Okay, so this is uh, the quadrilateral, but uh, these are not. Uh, yes, so D, R, C, R, Q, B, B, and uh, A, and uh, this is what? <laughs> okay, and uh, this is A, B, C, D is a quadrilateral, and we have to prove that. Prove that AB plus CD equal to AD plus BC. Right. So let us write uh, what do we know. Given is that these are tangents. So PQ, uh, PB, BQ, CQ, RC, DR, DS, AS. These are all tangents. Okay, so what can you tell uh, about these tangents, uh, Aisha? What can you tell? Yeah, so we have to prove uh, this question. Okay, what can you tell about uh, the distance? Sir, so, um Remember whatever the theorem that we have learned in this exercise. So, so, so if we draw a radius from a circle, it would radius. be... No, no, no. You don't know. We don't need uh, the radius. Without the radius, we can solve. So, remember A, B, C, D are what points? For the circle, what are these uh, points? A, B, C, D. For that circle, what are these uh, points? Okay, let me simplify this question for you. So if this is x, then what can you tell about the other thing? Hmm. Yes. If pb is x, then what can you say? Looking at uh, pb, what can you say? Oh, we have three answers in the chat. Sir, dr equals to cq, yes, yes, bp equal to plus dr common point. Good, good. So, yeah, that is what we are getting at. Okay, so let me explain this question. This pb and qb are tangents from this point, outer point, uh, the points outside the circle. A, b, c, d are points outside the circle. Right, guys? Right, everyone? Yes, sir. And uh, they are touching at P, Q, R, and S point. Clear? So if I tell you guys that what is P, B, so this P, B would be equal to Q, B, as Ashit said. So is that uh, okay, guys? Yes, sir. So this is X, and if I write uh, this as Y, then this is what? Y. And then let's say this is Z. Then this DS is what? Z. Z. And then let's say this is W. So this is what? W. Okay, so now we have uh, named everything. Now let us find out uh, what is AB. So AB is 
AB is very good. AB is W plus X. Okay. And uh, CD is uh, what? Where is CD? CD. CD is uh, Y plus Z. Okay. Now if you calculate or if we can write uh, this as well. So what is uh, AD? What is AD? Yes. What is AD, Aisha? So uh, Z plus W. Good. So it is uh, Z plus W. And then uh, what is uh, what is this? A B C. What is B C? So it's Y plus X. Good. So now we have everything. So what we need to uh, prove A B plus C D. So let us find out uh, what is what is AB plus C, right? We are just following this question. So AB plus C, this is equal to W plus X plus, where is a CD, Y plus Z. So we can arrange this, right? We can arrange this and we can write it as Z plus W. So Z plus W plus y plus x. Can I do that? Yes? Yes, sir. So, what is z plus w? From here. Sir, a d. A d, right. So, a d. And then, what is y plus x? B c. B c. So, this was uh, this. Right. Okay, any doubt in this, uh, guys? Do you guys have any doubts? So we can also write AB plus CD and find it. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. And right. uh, AD yeah. plus BC and find it. And since both the RHS is equal, so it's yeah. equal. Yeah, yeah, we can do that uh, also. So that is uh, hectic. So that's why, yeah. You are saying that we can write AB as AP plus CB, right? No, sir. And yeah. Oh, yeah. What did you say? Are you saying that the same thing? AB plus CD is W plus X plus Y plus Z. And oh. AD plus BC is Z plus W plus Y plus X. So they're yeah. same. Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. Absolutely right. Absolutely right. So we can find out what is uh, AB plus uh, CD and we can also find out what is AD plus CD, right? This is what you're saying. Yes, yes, of course. So we can also find out what is uh, AD plus uh, BC. So AD is uh, what? W plus Z and uh, BC is uh, X plus Y. So this is also X plus Y plus Z plus W. This is AB plus uh, BC is also X plus Y plus Z plus W. So this is 1, this is uh, 2. So from 1 and 2, comparing 1 and 2, we can write. Yeah, this is what you're saying, right? Yes, sir. Yeah, yeah, of course, of course. Good, good. So we can also do this, right? Yes. Okay, and uh, yeah, so do you guys have any question in this, uh, any doubt in this question, guys? Sorry. No, Talha, Shweb, Ashid. Okay, this Aisha no. this problem and uh, Shaima also. Okay, so if uh, everybody, yeah, so no one has any question, please note it down, guys. So in your school, they will uh, prove it uh, like this. They will write AB equal to AP plus CB and uh, what? CD equal to RD plus RC. In this way, they will write all the things and uh, AD and uh, BC. 
and then they will add a p so the given is that what would be given that a p equal to a s and uh, what p b equal to p q and then similar things we will uh, use and then we have to fill with that but uh, this way is different right so you can do this by this method also but uh, Uh, can you scroll down? What should I move it? Should we write the right side also? Yeah, if you want. Uh... Can you show? Very good. Okay, yes. Uh, everybody, if all of you have noted down, please then. Done, sir. Uh, I should have noted Amar, Shweb, and Shaima. What about oh, Shaima, you did this problem. So, what about rest of you guys? Amar and Shweb. Uh, so, once again, yeah, done. Yeah, done. Okay, so now let us do the next question. So, next question uh, is one. Oh, Shweb, I forgot. Shweb. You forgot Shubu? Yeah, yeah. So, Oh, oh, I missed uh, because, yeah. Test, after, desk, test, desk. Yeah, yeah. Before Sh Aisha, it was Shweb said. So Shweb is not. Yeah, Shweb is not. Replied. Yeah, replied. yeah, that's why. Okay, so the ninth question is uh, Shweb's turn. Good, good. Uh, mm. Okay, good one, good one. Uh, good so. Yeah, thank you to, for. Oh, my mic is charging right now, man. Mic is charging. Yeah, he used headphones. Bluetooth, uh, Bluetooth microphone. Yeah. Okay, so. So then this one. So yeah, then this one it. <laughs> so this, this question is for you, Rizwan, right? Okay, sir. So. I will give one hint and uh, then you use that hint and tell me. Okay, so. This one and then. Okay, so this is O point and uh, this is, right, this is B, this is how many points are there? This is A, this is Y, oh, this is Y then. So in here, this is uh, Y. And then this is x, this is x prime, this is a uh, y prime, and then this is q, this is o, this is p. Okay, so given what is given? It is given that uh, x, y parallel to x prime, y prime, right? This is given. And uh, this y from y, we are drawing two tangents, AC and AP, right? And then uh, from B, we are drawing two tangents, BC and BK, right? So two tangents to a circle with O, uh, tangent AB with point O intersecting this y at uh, so AB. AB is tangent. And uh, this is also tangent, right? AP. And uh, this BQ. Right? Mm, yes, sir. Okay, so at B, we have to prove that AOB, right? So we have to prove that AOB, this one. This is uh, 90. Okay. So this we have to. This is I ninety degree. Have to prove. Yes. You have to prove this is ninety degree. Which one is ninety? Angle uh, AOB. Yeah, AOB. So we have to prove that. We have to prove that angle AOB is ninety. Okay. 
I will give you one hit, or let that me is. give you two hits. So one in in one in hint is that this x y also this is given. <laughs> so this is one hit, right? The second uh, hint is that uh, you have to forget about this one and uh, concentrate on concentrate on triangle A O. Right. We have to join O C. No, no, no. So we'll not. Uh, yeah, we will not. Can we? We can join OC and we'll get answer. No, no, no. So don't need to, yeah, no need to join OC. Without joining, we can. So I I have given you two hints. Right. So one hint is this, second hint is this. Concentrate on triangle AOB and specifically angle OAC and uh, angle what is that o p a right uh, so um, um we need to make line right o c uh, so o it will become uh, like yeah so it will become perpendicular so why you are uh, because yeah. finding 90 degree no no we have to prove that angle o a b this one angle. So we have to prove that this angle, whatever is this angle, this is 90. So why do we need this OC? Um, okay, there can be another method, but uh, I'll get, yeah. So we can join AC and we prove POA and AOC congruent by CPT and then equal, okay. So Hashid is saying that we can join OC and prove POA. P O A and uh, A O C. Okay, so P O A. I B. Yeah, so P O A, right? P O A and uh, A O C. So you can prove it congruent, uh, then this would be equal to this one, right? Mm -hmm. And then what? So these would be equal then, uh, then what, uh, Hashim? And we can prove that OQB and OBC become similar. So POQ is a straight line. Okay, so and we can prove OQB, OQB, right, OQB and uh, OBC, okay, OQB and OBC, they are... Uh, so the angle uh, QOB and angle BOC will be uh, equal. And, uh, okay, so, yeah, this way. Okay, so this is uh, the other method. So, Hashid is saying that first we prove that these two triangles are congruent, which means that this angle and this angle equal. Mm -hmm. And uh, then we prove that this OCB and OQB, they are congruent, so we have this angle and this angle equal. Right, and then we prove that, so this is, PQ is a straight line. This is a diameter. So X plus mm. this is what you're saying, Arshi. We add all and it yes, will become sir. 180. Okay, good. So we can also prove it uh, this way. Right. This is uh, one method. And uh, so we can prove that 2X plus 2Y is 180 degrees. So we can take common two and uh, this is 90. It will become 90. So X plus Y is 90. Good, yeah. So we can prove it uh, this way. Okay. So this is, this one is, uh, this is one method. Right. Okay. So, uh, yeah. And, uh, and what I was saying. So everybody understood uh, this method? 
Yes, sir. Yes, sir. So, so now let us try another method. Right. So, Tala understood about uh, this method. Oh, you didn't do this. Yes. Congruent. Yeah. No. Have, you have not done this congruent one, right? So, this proof congruent one, two, three, you didn't do. So, RHS by RHS, we prove that these are congruent. Right. Mm. So, you would see the uh, second method and then you think about this method. Okay. Yeah, everyone. Uh, so understood. Yes. Yes, sir. Okay. So yeah, what I was saying, good, good, Ash. So I was saying that, I was saying that this uh, x y and x prime y are all parallel, right? Which means that what can you say about uh, these two angles? What can you say about uh, these two angles? They're supplementary. They are supplementary. And uh, this is a line from the center. So what can you say about these two angles? This there is one. So this is x, this is x. Okay. So, so this is uh, x, this is x. This is what? Y and y. Right? Clear, guys? Mm, yes, sir. So, from here, what we can say that 2x plus 2y is uh, 180. So, x plus y is how much? 90. 90. So, now, in triangle AOB, x plus y is 90. So, what should we do? Yes. If x plus y is 90, then what would be this? 90 degree. 90. Right? Because mm -hmm. let's say this is uh, z. So x plus y plus, plus z is uh, 180. So this is 90 plus uh, angle z is 180. So z is Okay, so you can use it uh, this method or you can use it uh, this method. Any method you guys like. Okay. Yes, so I should, I should write it properly, right? Okay, you guys understood? Yes, sir. So in your school, you guys uh, write it in proper manner. But uh, yeah, but uh, the crux or the idea is important. So everyone, uh, yeah, Hashid is one I have understood. Tala, Shaima, Aisha, and uh, Shweb, what about you guys? Clear? Yes, sir. Okay, so please uh, you guys note it down and uh, then we'll do the 10th tenth, uh, tenth question, right? Okay, so we have only four to five minutes. You guys quickly note it down and then uh, we'll do the next question. Write it angles, interior angles on the same side of the So, you guys uh, saw that uh, we can have different methods to solve this in the problem, right? The idea is that. Uh, the end uh, we have to fix our end the goal we have to set and uh, we can use any method If everyone has noted it down, please uh, do. Go on, sir. Done. And uh, yes, Ashik, Tala, Shaima, Aisha, Shweb, Amar. What about okay. you guys? Noted. Okay. okay, so if everybody has uh, noted, uh, let me.
Okay, so Harshit, how is this chapter? Circle. Yes. Is this a difficult one or the easy one? Easy. Good, good. Oh, because in the school they are asking this type. So, good. Now let us uh, do this 10th question. So, whose turn is it? Is it is uh, Shyam answer, right? Prove that angle between the two tangents drawn from an external point to a circle O. So this part, uh, this part we already did, right? We have to prove that So we have to prove that these are supplements, right? So let's say this is P, Q, R, O. So we have to prove that angle O plus angle Q is uh, 180, right? So in the previous class, Aisha already told us about this problem. So uh, yeah, should we do this? But oh, uh, Tala was not uh, there. So Tala, okay, this this is for you. Tala. Homework for me. Skip. Homework, okay. So yeah, let's. So you you take it as your homework, okay. So if you want, yeah, please take it as your homework, and uh, I will give you one hint. So this angle and this angle. What is this angle? What are these angles? Tala. Yes. What did you say? Huh? What did you say? Ninety. Ninety. You say ninety. Yeah. These are the tangents, right? So this is point of contact. This is point of contact. This is a tangent, and this is the radius. So this is ninety. This is ninety. Right, this is 90, this is 90, O, P, Q, R is a quadrilateral, so that is your hint, okay? So now let us move on to the relevant uh, question. Eleventh one is the same question as, what? Same question as eighth question. So it is same as eighth. So now, Shaima, this is good. Right. Okay. It's already 31 and nobody is there. So, yes, Shaima, we have a parallelogram. And. Uh, so it's a triangle. Huh? Triangle? Where is the triangle? Prove that the parallelogram. No, no, no. So prove that the parallelogram circumscribing a circle is a wrong one. So we have a parallelogram and inside the parallelogram we have a circle. So my circle would be bad, but right. This is my circle. A, B, C, D is a parallelogram. Okay. So uh, what do we know already? What do we already know? We know that and uh, this we know. What we have to prove? So we have to prove that A, B, C, D is a rhombus. So what we need to prove, uh, Shaima? What we need to prove? The opposite sides are equal. So what we need to prove that it is a rhombus. Yes, Shyam. The diagonals are equal? No, 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 diagonals, uh, forget about the diagonal. What is rhombus? What is rhombus? Uh, 
on the basis of sites. So what is the wrong? Opposite sides are parallel. Opposite sides are parallel. So, so I am asking about the sides. Side. What can you tell about uh, the sides? Should mark points where the tangent touches. Uh, okay. So yes, yes. So the rhombus, uh, all sides are equal for rhombus, right? Shaima, so the all sides are equal for rhombus, right? Yes. Yeah, so, okay, if we do, yes, yes, Harsh. So this is already given that opposite sides are equal. So if I prove as uh, Hashid is saying, if I prove that AB equal to AD, if I prove that, which means that all the sides would be equal, right? Because AB equal to DC, BC equal to AD, this is given. And if I prove that AB equal to AD, so AD equal to BC, so AB equal to BC. And AB equal to DC, so AD and DC are equal. So which means that all sides are equal. So what I need to prove, uh, Shaima? AB equals AD. Yeah, if I prove that adjacent sides are equal, and it is already given that these opposite sides are equal, then we will prove that uh, AB equal to BC equal to CB equal to AD. So, okay, I guess everyone is here. Abir and... Uh, okay, so we'll uh, stop it here and uh, Tejasvi and Abir and... Uh, okay, on you guys are here. Where is uh, Abir? Okay. So we have to prove uh, this one. I will give you a hint. Hint is that you already know that uh, these are equal. So AB plus CD, you guys already know that AB plus CD, this is equal to what? AD plus BC. Proved earlier. So first you need to prove uh, this. This you already know, right? This you guys already know, right? Yes, sir. So you prove uh, this first and then in place of CD you write AB. In place of uh, BC you write AD. So 2AB equal to 2AD. So, A, B equal to A, right? This was our goal. Okay, I will discuss this question in the next class. So, oh, it's already seven minutes, guys. Sorry, sorry, sorry. So, yeah, bye, guys. Bye, Rizwan. Bye, Tala. Bye, Shaima. Bye. Bye, Aisha, bye. Ashish. Goodbye.